Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So yesterday in my region, the 8th of August was Patch Tuesday, which means it's the second Tuesday and was the second Tuesday of the month. So it's Patch Tuesday and that means that Microsoft has started running out the monthly security update for Windows 10, also known as a B-release update for August 2023. Now the update, because uh, it will be installed automatically, and once it's installed, if we head to view update history, uh, the security update for this month is KB5029244 and has rolled out for Windows 10 versions 22H2 and Windows 10 21H2. Now the updates that do roll out on the second Tuesday of the month um, are security security updates which address and fix security issues for your Windows 10 operating system and obviously this month it's no different and we get 32 vulnerabilities that have been addressed for Windows 10 overall with the update which means this is an important security update and out of those 32 vulnerabilities that the update does address three are critical vulnerabilities which is your highest ranked vulnerability so important security updates rolling out this month and all three of those critical vulnerabilities that have been patched with KB5029244 are remote code execution vulnerabilities, which means the bad guys, the hackers, the attackers can try to gain access uh, to your Windows 10 machine over the internet or over a network. So important security update rolling out, three critical vulnerabilities addressed, 32 vulnerabilities and flaws have been patched and fixed with this update in total. Now over and above, uh, the update being a security update. Um, the B-release updates also include the quality improvements that were part of the previous month's optional bug fix update. So for Windows 10, uh, the update that rolled out near the end of July, on the 25th, 26th of July, depending on your region, was KB5028244. And this update, which I did post on, and by the way, I'll leave a link to that video down below so you can go check that out more in depth. Um, the update fixes timeout detection and recovery TDR errors, fixes display and audio issues, fixes VPN problems, fixes search app issues, fixes a Windows fail problem related to BitLocker and includes numerous other fixes. So this update, KB5028244, those quality improvements, if you didn't install the update um, at the end of last month because it was an optional update, then as mentioned, those improvements will be carried over into this month's update and over and above that that's more or less what's new and um, we also get an update for the servicing stack which uh, is the component that installs windows updates so basically microsoft does make quality improvements to that on a month-to-month -month basis and there are no new features or anything like that that is rolling out and if we head over to winver about windows this will give us the latest version and build and for Windows 10 version 22H2, the OS build has been bumped up with this update to 19045.3324. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.